Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, thank you for stopping by and checking this amazing Walmart um, grocery haul that I did and it's an Ibotta um, rebate uh, haul is what I did. And um, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm going to be doing um, Walmart, Target, Dollar Tree, Walgreens and CVS um, now starting weekly. I am finally out and about. So this weekend I hit, I did go to Walmart, Target, and Walgreens. I have not made it to CVS yet, but I am very excited to show you the things that I got. And for those of you who are doing the couponing challenge with me, I want to show you that we can save money with our groceries buy what we need and how to do our grocery list um, around what coupons we have and things like that so the first things that I'm going to show you are my frozen foods so I can go ahead and put those away and um, these were the Tyson chicken nuggets these are the all-white meat and they're 29 ounces and these are the brand new hash brown chicken nuggets. These are also um, 25 ounces and they're all white meat. They're all natural. And I got those for the grandchildren that are going to be coming down for um, summer. Those were each $4.97. I had $1.50 off coupons from our newspapers um, a few weeks back. And then on Ibotta, I also had a, um, let me see what that one was. Uh, those were 75 cents each for those. And then I went ahead and I picked up one of the um, pepperoni mozzarella chicken snackers. And those are um, 1.12 pounds. And then I got the boneless chicken bites. And these are all white meat again, and these are 24 ounces. Now those were $6.98, and they had a $1.50 coupon on those, but those had a dollar rebate on them. So I went and I hit head and I picked up those four. The next thing that I got was the Apple Jack cereal. And this is the 12.2 um, ounces. And they were on sale for $2.48. I had a 75 cent coupon and then the rebate was $1.25. So that was a good one. And then I got, let me see. I got one of the Lala yogurts and this is in the strawberry. This is like the smoothie and it's seven ounces. They were 88 cents and I had a believe I had a 25 cent coupon for this and I had an 88 cent rebate so this was totally free I'm very happy for that one I did do the Lindsay olives now I did get the black ones and I got the sliced ones these are 4.5 ounces you had to buy two of them they were a dollar 44 each and I got um, 25 cents back for each of those so that was good the Hunt's barbecue sauce was a dollar forty-eight. I had a fifty cent coupon, and I also got a fifty cent rebate for that, so it was forty-eight cents. Then I did the Lindsay manzanillas olives. I got two of those. These were also a um, dollar eighty-eight, and then I got a dollar back on those, so I did that one. And then the last food that I got in this haul was, now let me, um, a disclaimer, we do not drink, but I do buy a lot of chicken and I did buy hot dogs and buns and crackers for the barbecue. So I took advantage of the, um, the Miller Lite. If you bought 12, a 12 pack of cans, Plus, any meat and rolls, you get a $10 um, I bought a bonus. So I went ahead and picked up the a big pack of chicken breast tenders. They're in the freezer. Or they're right here. Um, they're right here. Then I got the hot dog buns. And then I got um, little slider buns. 
a pack of the Sara Lee slider buns. Now, I really like these. These are the Hawaiian ones, and I just think that these are a lot easier for the kids to eat, so I picked that up. So that made me um, get my, my quota that I needed, so I got $10 back. So in actuality, I got the chicken for free. I bought the beer and the bread, and then the chicken pack was for free. So I did that one. And then I also did the Michelob Ultra 12-pack bottles. Now this I do cook with. I don't drink it, but I do cook with it in my barbecues. So with that deal was you had to buy the 12-pack bottles and then two bags of... Um, Ritz toasted chips, so I got the veggie, and I got the sour cream and onion, and then I get a $3 bonus for that one. So I went ahead and picked up all of that, you know, grocery-wise from that, and you can see that everything I bought, I did buy with a rebate. So let me um, now get into the non-food items, and let me tell you that I did, I made out like a bandit. Okay, my first um, deal that I got, let me look at my notes here so I'm not lying to you. I got the Tic Tacs. Oh, there went my Gatorade. I did do the Tic Tacs. Now these are on sale for $1.14 each. And I had this, I still had... 50 cent coupons for them so I paid 64 cents and then I turned in a five dollar rebate up to five times for each so what I did was I did three different transactions and on each transaction I did five of one color so I got these for 14 cents then the other transaction I did the five watermelon and then the five um, fresh mint so I did those and then in each of those transactions, I also did the Ensueño. This is the fabric softener. Now this is 267 at our store and it is 45 ounces. It is 267. I had a dollar coupon off, made it um, a dollar 67. And then the Ensueño had a dollar um, rebate. So I did this three times and I got these for 67 cents. So I did one of these with each of the Tic Tacs. And then I did the Visine. Now my store didn't have the little ones, so this did cost me $5.96. I did have a 75 cent coupon and then a $1.40 rebate. So this ended up costing me um, $3.81, but that's okay because I really do need the Visine and I bought it, I buy it anyway. So that was a good deal. Then I took advantage of the, the Benadryl, the Benadryl uh, lic um, liquid gels, the 24 caplets. These were $4.44 at my store. I had a dollar coupon and then a dollar 35 rebate from Ibotta, making this $2.11. Like you guys know that follow me, I do take a Benadryl every single day because of my allergy rash to my chemo. So I did that. Then the hubby wanted the Irish Spring 3-in-1. Now there was no rebate or anything with this. This was... Um, 287 and then I had a 75 cent coupon so it was um, cheaper there because Walgreens didn't have it when we went so he picked it up there then the next thing that I got from Walmart was um, the herbal lessons shampoo and conditioner it goes like this um, these were two 227 I believe they were I don't remember exactly what they were but um I had a 50 cent coupon for each of them and then the shampoo I got a dollar 15 and then the condition I got a dollar 20 which made them like um 86 cents each so that was a good deal I picked that up um I get that for my granddaughter the next thing that I got was the Procter and Gamble and for this you had to buy three items so I went ahead and picked up the secret deter um deodorant this is the Lux lavender 2.6 ounce i picked up the old spice swagger roll-on and this is the 3.0 
And then I also picked up the Dawn liquid for 88 cents. And by buying the three, you also get a um, $2 back from Ibotta above the, the rebates on that. So I really got a good deal on that one. Then I bought the Scrubbing Bubbles. I'm sorry, there's just so much stuff here. I, I, Oh my God, I just had a field day at the stores. It was raining, it's nasty out here in Florida, so I just spent my time waiting for the rain to stop at each store that I went to. Um, these are the scrubbing bubbles. These are the fresh gel little stoppers that you put in the toilet. I love these. Um, they didn't have the little one. They did give me the two month supply. So these turned out to be $2.97. I had the dollar fifty off coupons, and then um, they uh, I bought. I got a dollar back on each, so they only had two. So that's what I did. And these last, they almost last the whole month. Um, my bathroom downstairs does get used a lot because the, my home doubles as an office, so my downstairs bathroom does get used quite a lot. So this does last me almost the month, so I am very happy to get that. Then let's move along. Um, I did pick up batteries. Since we do have that tropical storm out there, I did pick up the two big packs of the AA and the AAA. We always have batteries on hand. So I did that one, and then I did buy the um, Cheapo Equate brand allergy because it was a really good deal. It was on clearance for $2.97, so I went ahead and picked up the um, 60 tablets of that. I picked up some odor eaters for my aunt. Um, she does have a really big foot, and it's really hard for her to find the insoles for her shoes. So I went ahead and picked this up. This is um, buy one and you get one free inside. It is the dog, the odor eaters, and um, it was a dollar ninety seven. So I did get that for her. She'll be happy. I did do the McCormick. Um, spices, you buy three and you get the $3 back from Ibotta. These are a dollar each, so they turned out to be um, totally free. And I did get the garlic herb and wine. Now, this, I also have the brown sugar bourbon or something like that, bourbon brown sugar. Now, this to me is a little bit too spicy if I use it full force. So what I do is I prepare a, a seasoning um, bottle and with all my regular spices in it, and then I add this to it. So it gives me just the little hint of this flavor in everything that I cook, you know, with this flavor in it. I do put my oregano, my olive oil, and everything. So I make my own spice blends with this, and it brings, it tones down this um, spice for me a little bit. So I did do that one. I did get some ink for my printer the Prima 245. I, I was out, you know, printing coupons. I ran out, so I had to get some more of those. And then the last thing I believe that I got were the Excedrin Tension Headache. Now, these are 100 caps. And let me tell you my deal. These were on clearance for $3.00. No, I'm sorry. They were clearanced at $5 and then they rang up at $2.50 and they had a um, $2 peely on each of them. So I got 100 caplets for five, um, 50 cents. 50 cents. And I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Now, the last thing that I got for um, this haul right here was a shirt for my husband for the barbecue. It just had this, the the you the it fell on the floor, so I can't show it to you. But it's just a t-shirt and it has an old style truck on it, and it says USA and Freedom. And that was my total um, Walmart haul. Now. My total for Walmart was $155.71 for everything that I bought, $155.71.
I got back from Ibotta um, $36.23 for my regular um, rebates. Then I got a $3 rebate for, um, I believe it was the Ensueño that I did separate. And then I got an additional $16 in bonuses for the, the two beers and my um, red, white, and blue brew, $5, the Procter & Gamble, my level three, and something else. So all in all, I got $65.23 in um, rebates. So my total out of pocket was $90.48. That's after my coupons, my rebates, and everything like that. $90.48. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six packs of meat, family style meat. I got three um, fabric softeners. I got, you know, a lot of cleaning supplies. I got a lot of medicine, bread. I mean, I, I think I did really, really good for $90.48 out of pocket. So I am gonna go and put all of this away. I hope you enjoyed everything that I got and I um, proved to you that you can do groceries on a budget, lower your cost, use your coupons, use your rebates, and you, know, you can see how it works out. So um, like I always say, always say a prayer for somebody less fortunate than you. Please hit the subscribe button if you haven't done our um, done that already. Join our, our you know join our family here. We all need the help, and I enjoy bringing you these hauls. And um, thank you for stopping by. You know, giving me a few minutes of your time, and I will be coming back with a Target mega haul and a Walgreens mega haul. So until then, happy shopping. Bye-bye.